Buy USDT with your credit card. It's easier than you think. Hey crypto enthusiasts, welcome back to Bitsbulls. Your boy Andrew here, and today we're diving into the world of USDT. That's tether to you newbies. Now, if you're looking for a smooth way to get your hands on some crypto, using a credit card to buy USDT is a great option. It's simple, fast, and gets you into the game quicker than a speeding bullet. But before we dive in, let's get the basics down. Tether, the stable coin that's basically a crypto version of the US dollar. It's known for its stability, which makes it a great choice for those who want to avoid the wild swings in the crypto market. So why use a credit card? Well, it's all about convenience and speed. You can skip the hassle of bank transfers and jump right into the action. Plus, credit cards are widely accepted, so you have plenty of options. Now, let's talk about how to actually buy USDT with a credit card. First things first, you need to find a reputable crypto exchange. We're talking about the big players like Binance, Coinbase, or Kraken. They'll let you buy with a credit card, so no worries there. Make sure you do your research, pick a platform with a good reputation and reasonable fees. Once you've chosen your exchange, you need to create an account. This involves providing some personal info and verifying your identity. Yeah, I know it's a bit of a pain, but it's all about security and following regulations. Think of it as a necessary evil. All right, now for the fun part, adding your credit card. Head to the payment settings and enter your card details. Most exchanges accept Visa and MasterCard, and some even offer Apple Pay and Google Pay. Now that you've linked your credit card, you're ready to buy some USDT. Select USDT from the available currencies, enter the amount you want to buy, and review the transaction details. Double check the amount of USDT you'll receive and any fees involved. If everything looks good, go ahead and make the purchase. Once you've got your USDT, it's time to move it to a safe cryptocurrency wallet. You can use the exchange's wallet, but a separate crypto wallet is generally considered more secure. Simply enter the address of your wallet and send your USDT. This way, you're in full control of your crypto. Now, using a credit card to buy USDT has its benefits, but there are also some things to keep in mind. You might encounter higher transaction fees compared to other payment methods. And make sure you read the fine print on your credit card agreement. Some companies consider crypto purchases as cash advances, which can lead to additional fees and interest rates. All right, in conclusion, using a credit card to buy USDT is a quick and easy way to get your feet wet in the crypto world. Just make sure you choose a reputable exchange, set up your account, and follow the steps we outlined. And don't forget to move your USDT to a safe wallet for maximum security. Oh, and before I forget, we're talking about a great way to earn some crypto. Invest and earn money together with successful crypto traders. Copy trades and earn money. Click the link in the video description to get started. Happy trading. And remember to like and subscribe for more crypto wisdom. See you in the next video.